Now, when you Google the word winter, it says the coldest season of the year in the northern, northern hemisphere from December to February and the southern hemisphere from June to August, which is correct. But there's always colds in these words. Now, when you're dealing with the, the Caucasians, the Caucasoids, when they used to live in a cave, the, the, the Caucasus Mountains, what they used to do was they used to um, force females into the cave with them during winter time. Now, the mallet uh, upside the head, you know, is pretty dramatic, but it was basically, you know, a forceful situation where it was a domestic they would, um, you know, pick them up, carry them on their shoulder and bring them into the cave if they didn't have no other male that was protecting them to keep them in there for the winter so they can have somebody, you know, uh, to cook, um, have sex with, whatnot, maybe a couple of children if it was a future thing. But when you break down the word winter, it basically is what the word is. Went in with her. Let me repeat. Went in with her. That's the true origins of the word winter from the English um, secret dictionary. So let me give you an example. When, when springtime came back around, it's springtime. They've been sitting in the caves, you know, for four or five months. They will come out and they, they will see all the other females walking around that didn't have a male. So it was pretty much free game. The sun's out. You know how it goes. It's the same situation when niggas be out in the summertime. They be in all summer. They've been in a relationship. And then as soon as summer hits... You know, they're, they're running the streets or, you know, they're working their job, but then they start fooling around because all these women are walking around <clears throat> and from being cooped up inside your house for so long, sometimes your t top, uh, st uh, st testosterone level starts to, uh, you know, starts to uh, seek and destroy or build because either you're going to seek, destroy or build. So... I was I was looking at this picture and obviously this is a modern day picture. This is not a caveman. Um, well, a modern one, but when you look at this picture, you see the water behind, you see her laying on the beach, she's being drugged into the cave or whatnot. And, you know, they're pretty much, you know, making a, a joke out of it. But, you know, the reality is that the word winter is basically broke down on how it sounds. Went ter. Went in with her. So when they would so when the caveman would come out the cave and they would talk in their, their caveman language and it was summertime and they didn't want nothing to deal with that female no more, they would tell the other caveman, yeah, I went in with her. I went in with her. Cause it's summertime. So they will say, yeah, basically I said, yeah. Basically what they're saying is, yeah, yeah, I hit that. I hit that. I had her in the caves. I went in with her. That's the one I brought in all winter. That's the one I brought in the caves all winter with me. Yeah, that's her. You know, then point to another one. Yeah, yeah, I had her two winters ago. You know, I went in with her two winters, this and that. So that's the secret origin of the word winter. And it's funny because... <clears throat> When you when you Google something, you go to Google, it never tells you the the um, the secret origin of, of the word. It's always something that has to deal with the climate, but never nothing that has to deal with um, the type of uh, um, environment that they were living in and what they were doing with the with the females at that time. So that's my that's my intake on the word winter. That's exactly what it means. That's they switch they switched it because they had to. They they can't tell you oh it can't you know this was a word that we use when um 
you know, December came around, November came around, that we started to be violent towards females and drag them into the caves and basically made them our, um, our slaves. So that's, you know, basically, you know, what, what niggas say, in-house pussy. They used to drag them in there and it'd be their in-house pussy. That's all the word winner is. That's the, the real origin of the word. And then they switch the origin over into um, a climate um, definition. So, yeah, you heard it first here. It's the chosen one, man. I'm out.